I'm Tiger Height, and not only am I going to make AEW Dynamite majestic again, but I'm going to make pro wrestling majestic again. The show itself was mid to fine at best, so if I was going to give it a thumb rating on this, I'll give it an Orange Cassidy thumbs up. But let's kick off with our first match, Chris Jericho and Daniel Garcia taking on Claudio Castagnoli and Wheeler Yuta. Why don't we build to a match like this? You'd feel like that this kind of match would be something where you fester for a couple of weeks, you get them emotionally invested because you just came off of the Brian Danielson and Daniel Garcia pseudo feud here, and then all of a sudden you kind of hogpodge them over to this rest of combat club sort of rivalry. And I get that the Blackpool Combat Club are a faction, but am I the only one who feels like it's not really a faction it just feels like a bunch of guys together that just have a common goal of beating other people up. It's just weird. I don't get it. At least Chris Jericho's team has synergy, and it kind of makes sense. But the match itself was fun. I actually did like this match. I thought the back and forth was okay. I thought Chris Jericho's psychology is still, I would say, fairly on point. Claudio Castagnoli continues to be incredibly impressive with how fluid he is overall. And Wheeler Yuta's just there. Well, Wheeler Yuta and Daniel Garcia, they're, they're just there. And it's unfortunate because they're probably as much of a draw as a bologna sandwich. But it was a neutralizer for the Blackpool Combat Club to pick up the victory. Not sure about that. Overall, it's fine. But if I was going to make this majestic again, I would build up to something. And because we already have two champions within Ring of Honor, let's do winner-take-all titles matches. I know it's a tag team going for singles champions, but to be honest with you, if you're going to do that, then it just seems logical to me. You have former champions. You have the current champions. It fits within Chris Jericho's little thing about facing all the former champions. Might as well do that. So that's what probably what I would have done, but we'll see where it goes from here. I'm kind of curious about it.